What's going on, YouTube? Mike go back with another TTM recap episode. Have seven returns coming in today from spring training. Can't wait to show them to you, but first off, I do have two return to senders. Got one from Ron Washington and one from R.A. Dickey, both, as you can see, to the Atlanta Braves. And the Braves do not sign fan mail during the spring. It's not so much even the Braves. It's the ESPN complex down there. They do not have, they just don't accept fan mail. So I had this problem two years ago. Last year, I didn't send anything. So I do have seven returns to show off today. So that's always nice. Definitely uh, looking forward to going through these. But before I show you my returns, I just want to make a quick announcement. Um, guys, I'm going to post his link down below. Troy Rudder, TTM Troy, uh, one of the big guys in, uh, in this hobby. He puts together amazing videos. I mean, top-notch production value. He wrote a book. I mean, most of you guys are already subscribed to him. For you guys who aren't, who are enjoying these videos, absolutely make sure you subscribe to him. He is at 989 subscribers. I want him to reach 1,000 tonight. So guys, check out TTM Troy. And now let's get to the TTMs coming in today. So this first one is coming in from Texas Rangers Spring Training. It's a one-of-one one success, returned in 13 days, signing a 2016 Allen and Ginter. Absolutely wonderful-looking guard. Signed it in blue is Faulkner here, Andrew Faulkner. So a uh, really nice return there. Nice rookie card. The blue looks really nice, especially with that Texas Rangers uniform. So happy to get that one back. Add it to the Allen and Ginter collection. Nice return there. Again, one of one, 13 days. All right. Next one. This one is coming out of St. Louis Cardinals uh, spring training. It's a two of two success return in 14 days. Just saw a hobby hangover. Get these back as well. Zach Duke. I actually sent to him a few years ago and never heard back, but uh, took a chance this year. Sign this in blue. Looks great. This is a 2016 Tops update. Absolutely wonderful looking card. And he also signed a 2017 Tops card in blue. Zach Duke. Um, it's hard to believe how long he's been around in the major leagues. Look at this one here. 2005. I still remember seeing him pitch with the Pirates at a uh, Phillies bobblehead day. Rainy night. Uh, I can't remember what bobblehead it was, but uh, I remember going to that game. And uh, now I got his autograph. All right. Got another one here coming out of. Seattle Mariners spring training. It's a one-of-one one success returned in 12 days. It's Taylor Motter featured here in his Tampa Bay Rays uniform. It actually lists him as an outfielder. I guess he kind of plays a little bit of everywhere, but uh, he actually made a really fantastic play last year at shortstop for Tampa. So I guess he does a little bit of everything. Signed this 2016 Topps update card in black. So a nice addition to the collection there. That was one of one in 12 days. Going to see a lot of rookie cards coming back out of 2016. Uh, Tops update sent a bunch out this spring. This next one is coming from the Cincinnati Reds and it is Tim Adelman signing one of one in 12 days. Signed it in black. Did get a little rubbing there unfortunately but still a really nice return. Shout out to AWMS, guys. You should be checking him out as well. Gets a lot of really nice TTMs in. Um, Andrew Williams, he is an awesome dude. And uh, Tim Adelman. Andrew, what do you think of Tim Adelman? Is he part of the Reds' future? That's one of one in 12 days. So we got a couple more to show off here. Let's see. Uh, first one, this one is coming from the Mariners. Mariners Spring Training. It's also a one of one in 12 days, so I've sent the same time as some of these others. He personalized it to Michael Dean Kiekeffer. So really nice uh, return there. One of one in 12 days. He also signed this 2016 Topps Update card. Uh, Topps Update is a series that it's not as popular as Series 1 and 2, but you can get a lot of uh, great cards in there. A lot of rookies, a lot of guys that uh, are very useful for signing um, the next day. So nice return there. All right, here's another Ginter success. And, guys, this guy's not exactly a great player. He's a nice little player. I've had a lot of trouble getting him, though, finally getting him. For the first time, one of one in 10 days, Josh Rutledge 
sent this one to Red Sox spring training and uh, got this nice 2013 Topps Allen and Ginter signed in black. I actually sent this exact card to him in 2014, uh, got an RTS on it, and then 2016, I sent a 2013 Topps Allen and Ginter, never heard back, sent another one this spring, and finally got it back, one of one, 10 days, so a nice quick return out of Josh Rutledge. That was sent to the Red Sox. And then finally today, this is my last return. You guys will recognize this one. This is a three of three success. Returned in 13 days. Sent it to Philly's spring training. And if you guys follow my videos and you watch my how to send a TTM video, you will recognize this card because this is the exact card. And the return is here from uh, what I showed in that video. Pat Neshek, the number one TTM signer among current and active athletes in sports, signing three of three in 13 days, signed his 2017 Topps card nicely in blue. His uh, Topps Heritage card for this year, his first Phillies release, will be coming out in just a matter of days, so that one's going to look awesome signed too. Along with that Topps card, I sent this uh, one here. This is from, what, I think 2010? No, 2009. Beautiful looking card. Uh, the colors really lend well to an autograph. Really nice one there. And, of course, in Allen & Ginter. 2008 Allen & Ginter signed big in blue. Beautiful looking card. So, guys, if you have not sent to Pat Neshek, if he's not part of your autograph collection, I highly suggest you uh, change that and send it his way. He's happy to sign. So, guys, there you have it. A 7 TTM success coming out of spring training. You send stuff out, you get stuff back, guys. Comment below. Let me know what you think of all these successes. Hit the like button, subscribe, and I'll talk to you next time. Have a great one.